the role of the elder is probably the most significant role that that one can reach in our, in our, in our way of life in our society. The elders say that when you reach the, the level of, of becoming an elder, you are a being that is most closest to the Creator, next to the child, that has just come from the Creator. And the elders of our society have always had a deep, profound influence of offering guidance, direction, and discipline to to the community, to the family, and to the individual because of their experience of life. These feathers, sometimes they'll come to you and land right beside you. Where did they come from? Even in the city, I was in the city 15 years ago, and this plume, we were doing a ceremony and this poem came and landed right in front of us and everything is, is locked in the apartment you are shown something I was shown that I was being listened to I was told that we are here when you need me when you need us During the event of the Igniting the Fire gathering, there was a, an appearance of uh, many, many little turtles. As I was uh, chairing the event, uh, there were people that came to me to show me these little turtles that appeared. And then I went to the elders to seek their, their advice as to what was the meaning for the appearance of these turtles. And the response was really very simple and what the elders had had replied, it was a sign of a new life that had, that had arrived. Little snapper, look. Little snapper. Oh, look at that. Eh? <laughs> it was a sign of a time of, uh, that the rebirth of our people had, uh, had taken place in, in this event. saw the turtle crawl out of the fire and then it was crawling away from the fire and I picked it up and took it out of the ro outside the rocks and it just crawled right back in and headed towards the fire and went right in and it died there. Little turtle spirit wanted to give himself to the ceremony and that's the offering he was making. He was making his, his uh, sacrificing his life and uh, that sacrifice of life is truth and that's what uh, I think has to be reflected here for the Anishinaabe people when they come to, the, to this sacred place they're searching for truth and answers and I think that was the message. that we would prepare for the coming of those that have not yet arrived, our grandchildren and our great-grandchildren. We'll have some place to go and to know who they are, how great that they are, and how they are so special for each one of you. We must be able to reach a much higher spirit of, of influence to guide us into that new world. Because originally the Creator had a vision of peace and love. That was the essence of His vision. And as human beings, I believe that we have, we have been put here to come and bring fulfillment to the great vision of the Creator, and that is to bring love and peace into the world. All we need to do is, is connect with that higher power of spirit of love and bring those acts of kindness and, and compassion into this world and let go of all of those things that have, that have hurt us and make us sick. The 
young people are going to, of course, play a very significant role in the unfolding of the new life. But the young people cannot do it without, without the mentorship, without uh, the knowledge and the direction of the elders, because the elders are, are in the position to seek higher direction in ceremony from the spirit of the world. Last night I had a really hard time to sleep. Not because I was sad, it was because I was happy. And to me, it, it was because of the collective spirit that we felt in this gathering. That each and every one of you brought something into this gathering which advanced us to a really strong environment of, of love and family. There were so many things that happened in this gathering that maybe it will take time for everything to sink in for us to remember what a beautiful time that we had. But one thing I can say for sure, it was the elders that brought that feeling of so much joy in this experience that I had in this gathering. And through the direction that we were given in ceremony, we are being asked to come back again. 